Hello guys, today we try just to speak about something psychological about the traders and this uh, problem, uh, the investors, they don't have this problem, only the traders and uh, I will explain in, in order just to get an idea. Now, investors when they choose companies to invest in, they know beforehand that they should wait many years like uh, Warren Buffett said when you choose a company you should wait or you should invest at least 20 years it means you 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 are sure that this company will expand and it will make uh, progress that's why uh, you, you can buy uh, shares and each year or two years when the company becomes bigger and bigger and the stock becomes bigger you can buy more buy more buy more if this company is doing good so investors are not worried about money right now let's say if, if an investor buys this year he doesn't he doesn't uh, uh, think or he, he is not worried that the stock will make him, uh, the companies that he bought will make him money. So he's not wor worried at all because he knows that investing needs time, needs many years, five years, 10 years, 20 years, in order that the company becomes bigger and bigger and then makes more money, more dividend, and so on. The opposite is the problem is facing is traders, a day trader and swing trader especially day traders they want money now now the problem with uh, with this thing if day traders are just new they have a small account 1000 2000 5000 10000 it's a small account and they want to push their account very hard to make more money because the problem there are other people, they tell them, okay, uh, with $100, you can make $100,000 a month. I have, seen, I have seen this video of some guys, you know, these guys online, they don't tell the truth about trading, that you need money, you need to practice, you need uh, harder training. It's, it's, it's a business, okay, in order to make money. So if you have 1,000, try to save more money to have 5,000, 10,000, 20,000. It means you need money when you know how to trade. And, and the other time you can make money. But uh, the problem is that because these beginners, they watch a lot of videos and someone tells them, uh, this I have seen it with my own eyes. Okay? You go to a video of, of one guy and he told them, okay, just bring $100. Uh, and you make one hundred thousand dollars a month. Not <laughs> so. <laughs> I don't know how do they do it, uh, uh, but uh, uh, hope they have a machine to uh, to print uh, one hundred dollars in their homes. This I, I guess they can they can do that. Okay. So this is the type of information that it is online, and it is spoiling the minds of beginners, and that's why a beginner. Uh, he thinks that uh, getting money from the market should be like that. And in real trading, it, it should never be like that. Okay? It should never be like that because this is just something about dreams. People, they, they want to have just $500 or $1,000, $2,000. And each day they make $1,000 because they go to uh, penny stocks and they can, they can make money. They see a stock. Oh, it was five cents. Now it is five dollars in two months or six months. Oh, and they begin to calculate how much they make if they buy it at five cents and it go to four dollars. Yes, this stock has has gone from five cents to four dollars or five dollars. And people who were there, they are they they have made a lot of a lot of money. But this is an exception. You find one stock out of 20,000 stock that do this and this is manipulation it means when the stock goes so high like this it is a kind of manipulation that uh, it's not uh, it's not uh, something that comes that uh, that all the people know okay so 
in order to avoid this kind of problems, frustrations that you are not making money, you should understand that making money goes through stages. You, you are a beginner, for example, you have never traded before or you just have an interest in trading, try to take the, uh, the good path or the good way to make money is to practice. Open, uh, uh, for example, uh, a free account, a broker account, which is free, and try to practice. Get a training or try to, uh, to practice by yourself. Have your own rules. And after a few years, when you, when you master the trade, and then the only thing you need when you become very good at trading is money. If you have 50,000, it's better that you have 20,000. If you have 100,000, it's better to have 50,000. At that stage, you need money to make money, and it, it will be just a game of making money. At that stage. But at the beginner stage, you should be humble and simple and try to work hard in order to acquire the techniques in order to trade. This is the most important thing. Okay? So the people, they neglect training, they neglect to practice a lot, and they, uh, from the other side, they want a high performance from their account. Okay? Uh, so someone uh, sent me an email before. He has $45,000. He lost it all in trading, you know, penny stocks. And then when he, fi when he has like 5000 it means he lost $40,000 uh, doing especially those uh, uh, what we call OTC stocks. Okay, which which are very 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 dangerous uh, trades because you can make sometimes money, but other times you will lose it all because the stocks are so volatile in the OTC, which is over the counter. Now, the stocks in uh, in um, uh, in um, the three major uh, exchanges like penny stocks. Most of them, they are, they are not volatile, but some of them, some of them are manipulated and you see the manipulation very easily. The pep and dem scheme, you see it always. And uh, if you are in and you can make money, and it could be, but this is very, very quick. So to solve this problem of frustration, you should think, change your ideas about trading, that it is a business. In the business, you need money. You need to know your business. To know your business, it means if you are a day trader, you should know the techniques. How to day trade? This is, this is the simplest thing I can say to you. You can just uh, uh, come with 20,000 or 10,000. You say, oh, I will begin trading. Uh, where do you go? You go to penny stocks, which are the most dangerous because you see a stock is five cents. It goes to a few dollars. And you see, man, if I put 5,000, 10,000 in five cents, and then after a few days or one month, I get five dollars, I will be a millionaire. Yes, you will be. But it's like, it's like gambling. It's like uh, when you, uh, you are thinking of, uh, you are thinking about, um, for example, uh, um, making, 150 million or 200 million with a jackpot this is the dream of all gamblers now if you become uh, you have the mindset of a gambler you will follow this dream even if you have a big money you have 50,000 and um, if, if you have for example sorry for that if you have uh, uh, let's say 50,000, 100,000, and you go to this OTC, over-the-counter stocks, or you go to penny stocks, and you begin to play, believe it or not, you will lose all your money tr tr uh, trying. Now, why is that? Because most of the people, they want to go there, they have this idea to become a millionaire very, very quick. Even if they have 50,000, 100,000, 200,000, I know a lot of people, they lost all, all their money trying. And um, that is 
that is uh, a problem that all most beginners they they do okay and uh, for my opinion the first steps you do in order not to get frustrated about money and you always think to make money first you should protect your money first you have five thousand you have ten thousand you should protect yourself and practice get the techniques and begin slow don't put all your money and um and then whenever you are um you are good at it and then what you do you can make money slowly and then you have a very large uh, account and then you can make a lot of money okay so thank you very much for watching and if you have ideas or you have uh, some questions please ask thank you very much and see you uh, tomorrow